Uh, the domestic violence program serves uh, victims of domestic violence and their children, uh, women, children, and men, because there are male victims of domestic violence. Um, they do not use the residential services, but they receive the other services of the shelter. Our goal is to help them to develop a violence-free life uh, by um, having them to set goals for themselves and to achieve those goals. Uh, with the help of the resources here in, within the community and whatever other resources are available to them. Um, for both programs, we have a life skills training, which helps them with everyday life skills, budgeting, um, nutrition, those kinds of things. We assist with, um, we have parenting uh, issues that we help them with, housing, uh, uh, pre preparation for job, part of the program as far as a transitional program is to get them into permanent housing. So uh, we work along with uh, the Holland and we they go from the transitional program if they're eligible for that program to the uh, apartments that are available in the uh, Holland. Through the job uh, assistance program uh, we have worked with them on how to prepare themselves to get job, how to find employment, uh, so that they can get back out in the community and we've had those that have uh, been successful at finding employment and getting back on their feet and moved into permanent housing outside of even the Holland. The purpose of the transitional shelter services is for women and children who are homeless and we do have rooms for families, so we have rooms for single women um, and we have a dormitory style living up there. So we do provide services for women and children who are home. What is, what's the average time it takes uh, for someone to move through the transitional program and start to get back on their feet? The average time I would say is six months. The program is a six month, I mean, I'm sorry, a year long program. Um, they can stay up to a year and during that time we assist them as we do in the domestic violence program with a job, a job assistance, uh, life skills, um, basically the same services we're providing for residential uh, domestic violence. Moretta, how did you get involved in human services and what's a little bit about your background? I was a volunteer. I came in, a friend had me come in to the uh, shelter as a volunteer almost 30 years ago. Um, and within a six month time period I was hired as full time staff. I started out with the sexual assault program and I was hired for domestic violence. What makes you stay with it? It's got to be, some days it's got to be uh, stressful, some days it's got to be sad. Uh, what, what keeps you coming to work every day? Every day is stressful um, and there are the sad days but what keeps me going is I have to give back what was given to me.